is the infirmary. Strained hamstring earlier this month. And he's going to go the other way. Josh Naylor fading back, and it's gone! Second pitch of the game. Byron Buxton muscles up. It's his eighth home run of the season. Bring it in, drive! Get up, ball! Get out! Well, he found the ball he wanted to hit. You know what's what have been the most impressive? Here's the 3-2 pitch. Swinging a drive deep to center. Get up, ball. Get out of here. God. His second home run of the night to straightaway center. Want to let that go as long as it can, but like we talked about. Fly ball. Belton. He's back. Long home run. How far up the bleachers is that going? So here you go. This is the matchup everybody's looking for. Bases loaded one out. Vladdy Guerrero against Max Scherzer. And our Blue Jays are down by three. And this is why we came, right? To see these kind of matchups. Man, mono and mono right here. Two and one. Swing it and drive. Get up, ball. Get out of here. And grand slam for Vladdy Guerrero Jr. A difficult lineup to get through unscathed and Buxton launches that's not coming back that is going to be way out of here hits a scoreboard two run home run for Byron Buxton and the twins now with a 5 2 lead scary power this guy man that got out of here in a flash and that's one thing Yardley did such a good job of last year keeping the ball in the ballpark they need to be to make good contact. Oh, Tani crushes it to deep right field. Good. Bye. Shohei going way back, right center, made the adjustment. And what a swing for Otani. For the last few years, no longer the days where you let it ride. Uh-oh, that ball's hammered. Buxton is going to send one out of here, and the Twins strike first. Solo home run, right center field. Byron Buxton breaks it up. Well, he's got some kind of power, that man. Goodness. Rebuilding trust. That one's driven out to right field and deep. Frazier back, turning, looking. See ya. It is 1-0 Blue Jays. Guerrero with a bullet home run to right field. This is the third time in this series we've seen Guerrero. One of them was off Cole opening day. That high fastball out over the plate is just a pitch with his kind of swing that he can handle. And again, this ball up in the strike zone. First pitch swinging. Oh, and first pitch crushing! Oh, man! Lean into it! One nothing, Angels. Matty, we said it at the start. I mean, here's a guy that throws a ball 101. Strike for a while. He shook off fastball, went to a slider. And that one is cracked high and deep to left, and Acuna Jr. has done it again. The Braves with a four solo homer barrage here in the first two plus innings. This guy's pretty good. Well, it was a hanger. Opening day in the district, play ball. 407 first pitch and a high fly ball to deep left field, and Acuna is admiring it as the Braves go on top on the first pitch of the Nationals season. His third hit of the year, his first home run. Braves have only hit three total, and he really watched that one float way out of here.
as well. Drives one to deep left, and we are tied. Buxton with a bat flip. He's having fun in his first at bat, and he tags Cisnero to deep left field. Got behind in the count, came with a heater, and he was ready. Ground ball, yep. yep. Fielder's choice. A high fly to left. Haggerty back. No chance. Buxton again with an extra base hit. He now has seven hits, three doubles, and four home runs. I mean, what can you say? I mean, this is another no doubter as well. I mean, the other first three were over half of that breaking ball. Bring it and drive. Deep to center field. Get up, get out of here, and gone. Vladdy Guerrero Jr. with his second home run of the season. And the Blue Jays have scored three in the bottom of the first to take a 3 1 lead. Telling you, they were flirting with danger up in the strike zone against Vladimir Guerrero. I don't care if you were just trying to show him that pitch. You are. Center field. That ball is belted. That ball is way out of here. I've waited 19 months to say. Top of the fifth, Shohei Otani hits a high, deep drive to center field. Davis is at the track. This one's going to go. Otani, with his second extra base hit of the night, has gone deep to center field. His third home run of the season. He had a heck of a play by the fan out there. That was a no doubt about it. A lot like the Mike Trout home run that we saw in last night's game. Velocity, and according to StatCast, First, this swing by Albies and a drive, but rather by Acuna and a drive to center that's going to go. Ronald Acuna Jr. has done it again. Oh, he was ready for the velo that time. Mm. I mean, we're watching something so special here 108 miles an hour. I did not like the pitch. It was a little high fly left center and deep Tramel back. He's done it again. He is absolutely locked in. This is fun to watch. I mean. He's on everything. You can't, there's no part of the strike zone you can attack. Oh, oh my. How far will that one go? Well, that is his fourth home run. So the Angels are on the board. It's a two to one game. All out tonight. 1-1. One, one. In the air. That's well hit. That's down the line. That ball is gone. He does it again.
Well, the trend continued. We've seen him hot, Tommy. I, I, I just don't remember a stretch where he's been. Back in September of 88. Oh, how big is that double play now? Guerrero hits one that bounces up into the upper level of seats. That guy showed up not expecting to go home with a souvenir. And Vladimir Guerrero Jr. makes it a 7-5 game. And what would have happened if that throw on the previous play sailed into center field? We'd be talking about a tie game right now. That's right. First pitch swing, high fly ball left field. Dickerson going back to the warning track. That ball is gone. A majestic home run for Acuna. And just like that, the Braves are back in the game. His unbelievable month continues. Instead of a four, uh, you can't keep running. Mike Miner beginning the sixth inning. He's given up three runs, five hits. And that is hit deep to left field. And Vladimir Guerrero Jr. makes it four runs on six hits. That's his second hit of the game. It is his second home run of the series. And with the Royals down to their last six outs on offense, Toronto makes it a 4 nothing game in the sixth. I guess that, that speaks to that movement right on the fastball. Shohei Otani hits a high fly ball to right field. To the wall. Goodbye. Hey, by the way, he's got a pretty good sprint going around. He won't even let us enjoy that home run for Shohei Otani. Let's get his sprint speed on that. One out. Buxton, the hitter. Buxton hits one deep to left center field. That is not good. Buxton with a two run homer. And the Twins take the lead 12 to 10. And he's had a day. He's had a year. Six home runs now for Buxton on the season. Yeah. We ever get to the bottom of that, but I thought that was great. You got the story? Oh, ball hit high and deep to center field, all the way back, straw near the wall, and it's over the wall. Otani is flying around the bases, but it doesn't matter. That's a home run. That's his thing. Showing off the stack cast speed. He, he hit a bomb in Kansas City and went flying. Man, that guy's got all the power, all the speed, incredible arm. All time. Unfortunately, cut short. Shohei Otani drills one deep to center field. This ball is crushed and off the Budweiser party deck, bouncing around out there. Otani picking on an 0-1 pitch from Luis Garcia and sending it out to deep center field. Home run number seven on the year for Otani, and the Angels regain the lead three to two. That was 107 point. Buxton drives one a deep left Rosario back looking up and that is gone. Byron Buxton. With his seventh home run of the season so he joins the seven home run club with a two out solo shot here in the eighth inning.